so much for doing this the quiet way. Fabian, get Bones. Tell him to be ready at the window. Will do. Of course, I was the only one who could see Fabian, so that turned a few heads. But I didn't care about my college student ruse anymore. I had to get those people out of here. I've got a bomb! If you don't want to die, get out now! Several of the kids weren't sure if I was kidding. No one ran for the door. I pulled my gun out of its hidden holster and waved it. Get out now! No one waited to see if I was kidding anymore. But when Tammy tried to dart away, I grabbed her. A man barreled through the door, knocking the panicked deluge of students aside as if they were weightless. I shoved Tammy away and whipped out three of the silver knives that I had strapped to my legs. I waited until no one was in front of the man, then flung them. He didn't try to dodge my blades, and nothing happened when they landed in his chest. A ghoul. Great. I'd have to take his head off to kill him. Where was a big sword when I needed one? I launched myself at the ghoul, bear-hugging him. He pounded at my sides, smashing my ribs as he tried to shake me off. If I were human, the punishment from his fists would have killed me. But I was a full vampire now, so my broken bones healed almost instantly. I managed to put the gun to the ghoul's temple. Bullets wouldn't kill him, but they did a lot of damage. I kept pumping bullets into the ghoul's head until it was in oozing pieces. Tammy tried to run past me, but I was faster. What a ghoul! The ghoul was crawling toward us, his head healing with every second. I pulled my largest knife from under my sleeve, and with a hard swipe, I skewered the ghoul's neck. Time to go, cat. Hold on, Fabian. Fabian wrapped his spectral hands around my shoulders. <laughs> Tammy wasn't as trusting. Let me go, you! I'm not going to hurt you. She kept kicking, trying to break my hold on her. I ignored that and ran right at the window. <laughs> Since Tammy's classroom was on the third floor, we didn't have a long hang time. <clears throat> the vampire who caught us propelled straight upward. Flying me, Tammy, and the hitchhiking ghost toward the far edge of campus. Ah, somebody help me! Somebody has, love. <laughs>